Hey folks, Quilly Teen here, and welcome to Let's Play some Starfield! Now, I have been hesitant to do some Let's Play content for Starfield here for a couple of different reasons. One, we already have a really full schedule right now, uh, mostly as a result of Baldur's Gate 3. Um, and the last thing I need to do is to add like, another 200 hour game to our schedule. So this is just going to be Let's Play some Starfield. Basically, I'm going to spend today recording as much of it as possible in the early game. Um, and uh, we'll see how far we get, and we're going to see what we do with it. I have been playing on my own. I've got, uh, I don't know, maybe 20-ish hours into the game. Uh, maybe 30 at this point, I'm not sure, on my own. But we're going to be starting a new run over here. I have a few mods installed. You can take a look down below in the doobly-doo. Uh, mostly some, some things to help the inventory look a little bit better. And also, I am experimenting with mods to try to improve performance. That's one of the reasons, as well, I didn't want to really start doing the Let's Play of Starfield. I am having some performance issues with it. I actually have a fairly strong CPU uh, and I have a pretty decent uh, video card as well, an RTX 4070. But as uh, with, I think, many NVIDIA card owners, we are finding some optimizations issues with Starfield. Uh, so I have some mods to try to improve that as well. But it's been, it's been a little touch and go. So we'll see how well we can do over here. Oh, the other thing uh, I've been hesitant about doing Starfield, I have, um, I have very shaky hands. And as a result, watching me play a first-person game sometimes can be a little uh, a little iffy for people. So um, anyway, we'll see we'll see how we can do. Anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and start a new game of Starfield. Now, even on a, a good M2 drive, the load times are still kind of noticeable. Bethesda Game Studios presents. Starfield. Soul date, May 7, 2330. Argos Extractors Mining Outpost, Moon of Ectera. I realized I couldn't even look around here. Mouse not doing anything. That's a shame. In Skyrim, you can look around the wagon. Seals are good. Oxygen's good. Just do what you did last time, and you're fine. Follow my one simple oh, there we rule. Go. Hella, what's my one simple Listen rule? Listen to Lynn. Boss lady knows best. Exactly. Listen to me. Mining's just like any other job. Go steady. Go safe. Go home with a pocket full of credits at the end of the day. I don't wish the default yeah, camera. Yeah, totally. It's just like, like um, one third yeah, focus the on the uh, except uh, the with more cables, lasers, and accidental dismemberment. Very helpful. Thank you. Ah, you're gonna be fine. Your first outing was solid, and you know, let's be honest, it ain't exactly astrophysics. That's why I keep him around. Good pep talks. Yeah, and the fact that I can pinpoint a helium deposit from 300 meters. <laughs> Not untrue. A shame we won't find any down here. But the metal deposits alone should pay for our own helium. Hell, after this, we'll have enough jump fuel to bounce from one end of the settled systems to the next. Hey, more minerals, more money. And so the cycle repeats itself. Just no more unauthorized jumps in the house for room space, okay? He's just a big baby. There are worse lives. You know, most Dusties don't even make it this far. I have a good feeling about you. A uh, group hug now or at the end of the ship? I, I have a feeling that we're going to be doing a lot in this what universe, too. Tella? I don't know I why. I am going to leave you behind. Promises, promises. I kind of assume the straps wiggling animation here is baked in. I don't think that's real time physics. It could be. All right. Okay. Let's Let's move. What we've got. How are we on time? A uh, little longer. Grab some samples. Always. I don't know if there's Those anything interactable here. Oh, I can't even Elizabeth. run or anything like that. Make sure she eases up on the breach. I don't feel like Move getting buried to alive today. Super casual walking Roger speed. That. Remember, but Dusty, yeah. keep your breathing steady and never take that helmet off down here. Oxygen. Can I even? No, I can't access the inventory. Right, we can't do anything that would reveal yeah. our character. We can't even. Uh, we drill on a rock we can't even pop the third atmosphere. person view, which is interesting. Know what I love about working because we do have a full suit on, but I guess. Because there'd be a glass. Uh, a job front. like this in the United Colonies? 
<laughs> if they'd given us an o a fully opaque helmet, then they probably could have enabled third person. Uh, Although, ooh, we didn't even choose our, our body type at this point, Calvert. right? No! Ah, uh, no, no, no! It's a laser, not a sledgehammer! Ease up! Benning, if you got paid per break, you'd be a millionaire! That's like Let's natural go. rock formation, or just some sort of like sticky support to set up in the mine? You make your cut, you get your cut. No exceptions. Come on, pick it up. Excellent. What's the yield? Minimal at this point. Occasional glimmer, but it's weak. What do you think? Stay the course? No, I don't man. even know how this mining Stay works. First of all, none of their lasers seem to do well, okay, anything. Okay then. And like, this one tucked. Why don't you move over to that big? I guess they're just vaporizing that. small veins yes, of things. I mean, that's how it works for the player as well. It almost make more sense if it was like looking like destructible to like terrain over here. I like the mining, like these square cut like even walls and uh, uh, ceilings. Well, we'll see the machine that does it. Is uh, is definitely a thing. Although we don't have any roof reinforcements, which certainly seems Dusty, questionable to me. You're up. Grab a cutter and mine what you can. All right. Oh, there we go. So now we are doing our run at normal speed, which is great. First tip I can give you if you uh, right click. Like, if you hold both mouse buttons at the same time, you, uh, you mine faster. Like a more powerful beam. We're ready, there. boss. Something Get back you sort up of here. discover accidentally as you go. Uh, Come on, you think we'll be it's done time. Soon? You're with me. Oh, now, one thing that drives me a little bonkers is how little interactivity there is around here. Like, nothing... You get some scorch marks, I guess, is that. Lynn doesn't even react to you shooting her. Um, you can't, like, pop the lights or damage the machinery again. It's some, a few scorch marks. This, look at this. Come on! At least whine. Now, some of the other characters over there do whine and get knocked about, but not the ones who are, I guess, cutscene here. Like, what's his name? Not Isabel. I hadn't noticed that before. Uh, scan is reading a clean break. Shutting down. Let's go. Yeah, I think this is a remarkably realistic machine for mining. Oh, uh. Hella, game. get the readings. I guess it must have yeah, been loading in a new part about of the world. That. Problem? Uh, not if you consider a spike in gravity readings a problem. Nah, that's fine. I don't. You don't? What we're after? It'll read as an anomaly. That's what I was told, anyway. Okay, now you're starting to freak me out. Relax. It's just another job. Come on. Oh, yeah, I didn't realize. Holding down the right mouse button actually makes our little crossers come We're getting close. Smoothly, like, uh, I think. Prepping the higher yeah, power mode? Yeah, just... <laughs> well, seriously. It does build up over time really as it zooms in, this. so I guess you can just hold right. Where and you're always ready to go in high power mode. Through there, I think. Okay, you. Right. You're up. I got it. goes wrong in there. Oh, yeah, F for flashlight, very handy dandy unless you're trying to do stealth. Um, but do, 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 I uh, I am running like uh, um, an LUT mod, a table mod to I, I guess that's a good change thing. the colorization. Just keep going. Do you see anything? I can pick up any of these. Oh, I can't get the Kalian input thing. I don't have a scanner yet. Get a little bit more as a bonus if we wanted to. That's interesting. I hadn't realized that. It's harder to tell when you don't have a scanner. Some of these are more cosmetic -y than others. There we go. Or I just didn't blast that one long enough. But I have found that before in these uh, artifact locations. I mean, I don't know if it makes sense to, like, pre-harvest some of this stuff. But it feels like it. Such a pack rat. Okay, let's just go in, uh... Artifact, I thought that was the color for it. I ran up. Uh, I guess it's not some navy... Grab it. Can. Let's do it. 
possibly go wrong. And one of the things I gotta say I like about this game, at least so far, again, with my 20 or 30 hours into it, um, you're not, it doesn't feel like you're a chosen one. There's nothing inherently special about you. Anyone who touches these artifacts gets a little vision. Um, I mean, the only thing that makes you special is the fact that I guess we're, we're more persistent and we're taking on more jobs to pick up more of these minerals as we go. And that, you know, enables certain things later on down the story. Hey, come on, come on. Okay, take it easy. You now, we're going to try to go pretty quick uh, on the character no creation physical here. physical damage. So that we can Mentally, the focus on the core gameplay. Out. I did spend no lot no of time on my character for my single player recruit game. for Argos Extractors? Ring any bells? Any of this uh -huh. look familiar? Oh. Wish I could nod up and down right now. Alrighty. So, <laughs> what I've done for one of my games is I just went to the preset 18 and uh, built based on that. But since I did that in my single player game, maybe... What's on 17? Oh yeah, the... Uh, to me, it looks like Chris Hadfield. All those people have said it looks a little like um, a John Cleese, maybe more, which might be kind of true. Let's go. Since my, my solo run is a female character, let's pick some sort of guy as a base. Uh, let me pick this guy, but we'll give him some hair. How about that? Do, do, do. Yeah, we'll, we'll go heavy set. That's going to be fine. Uh, hair. Let's give you, like, a big, glorious mane, my friend. Ooh, I got a... Oh, dang it. I hate that you... It's the scroll. I mean, it's fine that scrolling up and down here, although, you know what? The arrow keys is fine. So, yeah, it's, like, right-click and then pull back a little bit to try to zoom out. Um, I don't hate it, you know? Big old shaggy head. You know what? I'm kind of cool with that. Again, I, I kind of want to go through this relatively fast. We just be like... Kind of a little bit of a slob. I like that. I think I want to... change the facial hair color, though. I mean, you know, five o'clock shadow. Whether or not that's slovenly or just really hot. Depends a lot on the, everything else about, you know, your look, I suppose, right? All right, we're going to call that good enough because I think it's really funny and it's going to be a little bit different than my other character, which is good. Okay, in, in terms of background, we should actually talk about the strategy over here. Um, my first character, I started a character that was Explorer because it felt good. Um, and then I ended up restarting after a little bit um, because I wanted to I wanted to change my look, but I also wanted to uh, tweak a couple things about the background. And so my main character is actually the Cyber Runner over here. And it's gotten a few flavor events. It doesn't seem like your background has that much of an impact on the story. Just a few things here and there that seem to come up. The traits seem to come up a little bit more. Um, but uh, yeah, maybe, are we space trucker? You know what? I kind of like this. Maybe we, we're just a space trucker to start off with. Um, the, uh, I mean, the weightlifting early on is going to be nice just for extra carry capacity. Piloting is actually not a bad skill to unlock relatively early because it's kind of annoying to level up. If you do want to rank it up a bunch, um, you don't need to. So the higher ranks of piloting are just to access the, like, the higher end ships, which you definitely don't need. But you know what? I kind of like it. We're going to have the space trucker kind of vibe. That's kind of cool. Um, in terms of traits... Uh, my very first character had kid stuff, but then when I re-rolled, I didn't take it again. So I want to put kid stuff back in here because I think that's a cool idea. Um, maybe we could be an introvert if we're like used to sort of long haul, haul trucking by ourselves. Uh, we will, um, uh, we will consume more oxygen adventuring with human companions. So we'll either want to go completely solo, which could be, or we'll just go around with Vasco. And I think that might be okay because mostly I've been going, although... There are some story sections we're going to be forced to go around with another human companion, but I guess they're kind of far and few in between. Um, you know, I'm not entirely locked in on that. Extroverts actually seems pretty strong because it's really easy to just adventure with a human companion, and then you basically get the benefit all the time. Uh, Terraform I thought was pretty good. It feels like you do spend a lot of time running around on planet's surface, and so extra health and oxygen on the surface seems good. Yeah, it's less in space. I think for our character here, 
if we're a space trucker, it makes less sense. I don't think I'll take space though, just because it is kind of punishing on the on the terrain, which seems annoying. I'm thinking about grabbing one of the like factions or religions. So we could take like a free star collective who was raised, I don't know, universal. That's interesting. I'm also kind of curious about the dream home because I haven't done that. Healing and food items aren't as effective. You get more. Um, you know, maybe this is okay. We'll be free star collective settler raised universal uh, with the kid stuff. Although our parents are leave living in, I guess, United Colonies territory, right? I think that's where the, the, the family is. But Space Trucker, I feel like the Free Star Collective might be a better fit than the UC. All right, and I'm kind of curious about the, um, the the religion stuff, how that factors in, and whether or not that makes a big deal. All right, so we're going to go ahead and lock in here, and uh, I guess this will just be Quill. There you go. That's going to be fine. You do have another chance here to change the pronouns if you want, and let's confirm. I haven't looked at your record in some time. I appreciate that the game Good does do an autosave right before you get to this Being point. So if you want to skip the first part of the uh, prologue, the intro, you can skip well, directly Well, you got the sample. Client's on his way. Then we all get paid. You remember anything that happened? Um, there was this light. Music was incredible, like a dream or a vision. Everything went blank after I went into the tunnel. You know, I'm going to go with option three, because I went with, I think, one and two, the first other ones. Huh. Well, makes the paperwork easier. And we got I do feel like a lot of the conversation options in All Starfield kind of lead to the same result in the end. Huh. Uh, look like much. Sometimes Never literally with the same like. response from the NPCs. It's worth more than this mine has pulled in all month. Doesn't really matter. Will be speak of the death. Think just looking at the sound meters here. I think I'm going to go and bring down the audio a little bit more. I mean, it's mostly the voice that I have a little higher. I'm going to bring it down just a scooch. All right, there we go. What a handsome boy. Yeah. There we go. Hello. There we are. Now I do like to play first person. Some people really always like the over the shoulder. I think a lot of people who've played um, there's a lot of console games that are a little bit the sort of over the shoulder kind of thing. But I think I'm maybe a little old timey, and I like the pure first person view. Uh, it really hey, actually I'm depends on what saying, game I'm they playing. Got a reputation. Right, they're going that way. Hey, I don't know if I it's worth snooping a boot a little bit really before we poke outside. Whoa. There you go. Really Supervisor's story. log. It's Look day it. two of Argus Extractor's Victoria Dig. You got a few more collective to claim ID like Beta 7548 Alpha. Site setup was fairly painless. New record for us. 18 hours, including the elevator. The prefabs are starting to show their age, though. Time to rebudget for new equipment. Yeah, right. Again. The crew is good. Spirits are high enough. Hella is a pain in my ass. Theft. As always. And completely indispensable. What's the saying? The problem is, I love him. And he knows it. Ugh. Calvert remains the weak link. Hey, I can't open my Just flashlight. can't train away stupid. That's strange. But she's got a daughter on Mars or someplace and needs the cred, so... She gets one more chance. If she does wash out in the end, we've still got the Dusty. And there's definitely some promise there. Be glad when we're off this rock. Do, do, do. Now, one thing I did learn so far is that, oh, you really don't need to loot as many things as I did on my first go plenty of lives. These things don't sell for that much. That's a crafting thing, though. Um, actually, the food... Food heals disappointingly low. This has been a good run. I have to say. You lucked out um, the only food I've found really worthwhile making are the foods that give you the XP boost. So the alien tea, or boba tea. The, um... Shepherd's pie, which uh, is a recipe we can pick up quite early on. And, uh, apparently if you're doing kid stuff... Which we're gonna find out here. Mind if I steal Hell a sandwich? putting that no first reason. aid seminar to work. He was like, you, huh? Is it three HP? Four HP for that one. Like, what? What? A, what's uh, the point? I'm working. Bread though, because we can cook with that. All right. All right, Dusty. Airlock. Do do do. Uh, so we need to equip our helmet. So I am running the Star UI um, for inventory, which is very handy. 
And the other thing you'll notice over here are these icons over here for an another mod, um, which you can find the link down below. Uh, the mod that adds these icons, there are uh, uh, there's like a few different variants you can get. I download the variant that doesn't add the icons on the weapons and armor because I just preferred them. Uh, I, mostly I just wanted them in the aid. I wanted these little symbols here to be able to very quickly see at a glance uh, what these things are uh, are for. Um, Put your helmet on. Basically. All right, helmet equipped. Let's go. A little hitch there for some loading. Definitely don't envy anyone who has installed this game on a uh, hard drive as opposed to a uh, solid state disk because the load times and the hitching must be apocalyptic. Really? In a discovery class? That ship's older than this moon. It's not old. Come on. Not interested. Whatever it is. Leave that there because we'll get a little hint to pick it up in a second. All right, let's meet with the client. You guys respond to damage yet? Nope. All right. All right, I don't have a scanner yet either. I'm guessing maybe you only get the scanner after you visit the lodge? No, you get it before then, I'm sure. Barrett? A long time. As people have pointed out online, the uh, badges on their shoulder yes, here. Um, it depends. Been, right? Not every spacesuit's got it. Uh, but tells you the skills they get when like you uh, recruit them for your crew. mineral contract. Your tastes are a bit more sophisticated now, huh? Hey, Masco. So you found something? Right here. The new guy. Oh, no booster it. pack. That right. And everything went cool. Just like grabbing those minerals on Bendy. Kazal, and no Barrett, not cool. He passed out after the extraction, doesn't even remember what happened. Is that right, cowboy? Hey, I got this issue where um, trip, the huh? um, lip sync is completely out of sync on the first line of dialogue when you go into conversation every time. I don't know if that's like everyone's getting that issue or something about my computer setup or, or what it is, but it's been like that even before I installed any mods or anything like that. Do -do -do. You know what? We're just going to keep being reticent. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Nothing to talk about. All right. Apparently, I don't remember it. Not gonna lie, but reveling in the weird of space isn't everyone's idea yeah, of the fine. time. I get it. Look, just hand over the credits, and I'll be happy to never see this thing, or you, ever again. That's why I like you, Lynn. All business. Spirit, the scanners on the frontier are reporting a ship coming in hot from orbit. I really thought I'd lost them. Barrett? Holy shit! That's the Crimson Fleet! Weapons! Everybody get ready! So, optional grab a weapon. Now, Just like the emergency drill. here's the go, thing. Go. I don't think there's any reason to use this pistol over the cutter. It's like, yeah, the pistol's got, like, higher DPS uh, listed, but I have to feel like, I feel the cutter's really good. Anyway, I'm gonna put the cutter on one and the pistol on two. I feel early game, like the cutter's so good. The unlimited ammo part of it. And maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just like with the shaker hands, and shaky hands, I, I like the continuous beam aspect of it. That's why I tend to prefer like SMGs to one-shot rifles. Oh, like, like they just, they just melt. Certainly not flawless. Well, we may, may as well loot everything right now because we don't have anything in our inventory. We lost one miner there. Get the extra cutter out of it. Oh, I keep trying to hit F to open up my scanner. So we can highlight anything we might be missing. Also, I keep trying to activate my jump boost. Now that was some fine work on the pressure. 
You dug up the artifact, yeah, look right? Look how much like more interesting the framing that might be. Saw it. Is something the like visions? this. You're coming with me to Constellation. You're Although I guess part of it is now. because I'm choosing like a background that makes it a little more interesting, and the automated system wouldn't have that. Uh, tell me what this artifact is. I'm in. If you'll take me off this damn moon, sign me up. Oh, I didn't ask for any of it. You know what? We're going to keep being like Mr. Reticent here. I didn't ask for any of this. Hey, um, I wasn't going to bring it up, but we don't exactly know what the artifact might have done to your head, and Constellation is really the only group qualified to help. Oh, no, Barrett. No. You think you're just going to take off after the mess you caused? All right. I guess I did just put you all on the Crimson Fleet hit list. How about... I stay, and I send your Dusty here in my place. I, 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 I know, I know, but he's not some miner anymore, Lynn. Soon as he touched that rock, something changed. Don't tell me you can't feel it. Fine. It's a deal. Get out of here, Dusty. You're on to bigger things. <laughs> no way, not my job. Don't you get it? <laughs> you don't have a job here anymore. You're with those explorers now, like it or not. Yeah, we might embrace the whole reluctant hero thing to the Figure max. what happened to you when you touched that rock. Well, none of that's settled. Vasco, get him to the lodge. No deviations unless absolutely necessary, okay? Protocol Indigo. Indigo? Again. Very well. Oh, and hey, take this. You'll find it very useful out there. And it even tells the time. Whoa, it's like a it's like a phone that you wear on your wrist. But you can't make phone calls with it. Hey, look at that. The watch fits you perfectly. Well, the band is now, adjustable. Questions? I mean, I know I'm pretty big bone here, but chill out, buddy. Um Why send me? Shouldn't you go? Come on. You're really not at all curious about that light music show? No, man. Curious? why it only affected you? Because if you didn't notice, we've all been handling it since with no problem. The way I see it, Constellation needs that artifact, but they also need you. This mystery is only getting bigger each step we take. And you're part of it now. Oh man, I'm just in it for a paycheck. All right, <laughs> it's like, it is a little weird, like you're giving me your ship. Technically, it's not even mine. Consider it alone. Uh huh. Vasco will keep you. Although we can literally do anything with it, we can sell it. We can like since you can tell transform it. About that vision you had. All right. And All Vasco, right. don't let him break my ship. <laughs> it's fine. I'm a space trucker. I know how to do this. Doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop -a -doop. What we're gonna do? I think there's a great point for us to put a little cut in here. Hey, if you are new to the channel, of course, make sure to subscribe and, uh, as always, you know, hitting like and. Leaving a comment is really good for the old Yubtub algorithm. Uh, do check the description box down below for any additional info as well as some links to the mods I'm using. And I'll see you guys next time.